Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a makeup tutorial for you guys using a new brand from Ulta Beauty. Ulta Beauty is launching an entirely new and exclusive brand called Oma Beauty. The brand was inspired by the beauty and culture of Africa, so it boasts a lot of vivid and bold colors, and the shade range is actually crazy in the foundation. Uh, there's 51 shades of foundation. And what's unique about their foundations is that they have six color families that each have a unique base designed to target issues specific to the given skin tone. So I thought that was super cool. They launch with a variety of lip products. They have lip glosses, matte lipsticks. This one is their metallic lipstick. Look how pretty it is. And they also have concealers and contours and highlighters. So I really love the wide variety of products that they launched with. So now that you guys have like a little bit of background on the brand, I want to get started with the tutorial. And of course, I'm going to start with the eyes. I'm applying some Stay Woke Concealer by Oma Beauty. I'm using that as a base to prevent creasing of the eyeshadows. Next, going in with their Black Magic palette, I'm going to use Foxy as a transition color in the crease, and I'm going to blend like so. Next, I'm going to take this color here, and I don't know how to pronounce it. I think it's Olya. I'm not sure how to pronounce that, but it's like this really pretty red color, and I'm going to blend that right into the crease as well. And when I'm using deeper colors like this, I like to start in the outer crease and then work my way into the inner crease. And it should look something like this when I'm all done blending. Next, I'm going to take Warrior, which is a really deep red, and I'm going to put that on the outer corner only at first. And I'm just going to pack it on. And once I have it at the desired intensity, I'm going to start blending it so that it's not like harsh lines or anything. Next, I'm going to take this pretty shimmery color called She Tour, and I'm going to put that on the eyelid. After that, I'm going to put this glitter eyeshadow called Savage. <laughs> I really love that name, Savage. And I'm going to put that right on top of that She Tour color. And look how glittery and pretty it is. It's just so amazing and it's super like pigmented too. You don't need any... Um, glitter glue for that next for eyeliner. I'm using their Cleopatra ink Eyeliner and this is just a black eyeliner. I really love the tip on this because it's just it gives you lots of control And it gives you the right amount of product at the same time. So it's really easy to use And after that, I'm just gonna apply some mascara to prep for eyelashes you guys know I have to wear some false lashes. You don't have to wear lashes with this look, but I think it just kind of brings it all together. Next, I'm going in with Oma's Say What Weightless Foundation. It has a soft matte hydrating finish, and I love it. It's something that I've actually not, have not seen before in the market so it's very unique in it's finish and it looks just like your skin so if you want like full coverage apply generously but if you want like a soft to like medium coverage use just a little bit of it and for their concealer i'm using the stay woke concealer in the color honey t3 and I love the concealer, guys. It's such a beautiful finish, and it's so skin-like, and it blends really nicely as well. You can use either a brush or a sponge to blend it. I like using a damp sponge because it gives it a nice airbrush look. So moving into contour, I'm going to use their Double Take Scope and Strobe Dual Stick in Bronze Venus. And this contour stick, guys, is super creamy and i love it because it's so easy to blend and it gives like just the right amount of pigment so i'm using a brush at first to kind of like spread the product and um, then i'm going to go in with a sponge like a, a damp sponge and just blend everything out so that it's nice and seamless
So after everything is nicely blended, take your favorite setting powder and just set your whole face. I started with the concealer so that the under eyes doesn't crease. And then I just start setting my whole face. So taking that same dual stick, I'm going to take the other side of it and use the highlighter to highlight the high points of my cheekbones. So I'm applying it at first directly from the stick and then I go in with my finger to blend it and you just want to do a little, little taps so that you don't mess up the foundation underneath. To finish off the eyes, I'm going to go back in with Warrior which is that deep red color and put it on the outer um, bottom lash line and then I'm also going to take she tour and put it on the inner lower lash line like so After blending that out I'm going to apply some mascara to the bottom lashes and then taking that same dual stick I'm gonna get some of that highlighter and put it in the inner tear ducts for lipstick, I'm using their Coretta lipstick, and this is super pigmented. It's very lightweight. This has a silky texture, and it just glides on my lips. It's so moisturizing, and I love it. And after that, I'm going to apply some blush, and the look is complete. I hope that you guys enjoyed this look. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up, and let me know what you think in the comments. And I'll see you guys in the next one.